When I was 12 years old, my family moved from Montana to Northern Virginia. One of my favorite parts about moving so much growing up is that you gotta see how different people from different parts of the country have different values, and none of them are right or wrong. So whereas in the uh, middle of Montana, people are very much about, oh, we're, just, we're all friends, we're you know, doing stuff in the outdoors. People are pretty simple, not simple-minded. They just care about you know, very different things than people that live right outside of Washington, D.C., where it's a lot more about who you know, status, what school you're going to. Like when you're a kid, these are the types of things that people talk about. And being one of uh, being one of six kids, my parents didn't spend a lot of money on you know clothes for their children, especially since my dad was in the military. So I wanted to wear different clothes than my uh, than the ones I was getting from my second cousin Chris, who was much bigger than me. I asked my parents to take me shopping, and they're like, "Well, you, have, you already have clothes. I'm like, they don't fit me, and I want to be cool." And they're like, well, if you go make some money, you can go buy those clothes for yourself. How do I do that? So um, with a little bit of help from my parents, I figured out how to use like Microsoft Publisher to make flyers. And I dropped them off all over my neighborhood and started a lawnmower business. We got a bunch of customers and we held them for a couple of years. Me and my brother did. And it bought me clothes. It bought me uh, my first computer that I bought for myself. It, it kind of got my, my, first, uh, my first dopamine hit for... Man, you just go and like knock on a bunch of people's doors and ask for business. Eventually, some people will say yes to you. And 